Hey there YouTube, I'm Ikitsu, this is the Ikitsu Times, welcome to my channel, welcome to an obvious and devious trap of some sort. So yeah, there's just scientists sitting here, having a good time. Uh-huh. Okay, so the problem is I can't really turn while I've got this uh, out here, but... Alright. Oh, who's your poor monkey friend? He... is he alright? He looks a little under the weather. If I were you, I'd envy him. If I were me, I'd envy him as well. How do you commit suicide when you got no heart to stop, no hands to wield a chainsaw? What? <laughs> uh. All right, so I'm assuming I'm supposed to cut this guy's hand off, but uh, apparently that's not the answer here. Why can I not put this away? Okay, well, whatever. Nope. Huh. Really? Alright, well, that's interesting. Because I kinda need your hand, buddy. Could you lend me a hand? Ha ha ha. Uh, uh. Yeah, I didn't like that joke either. Alright, so there is a horrible monster roaming around here as well that is trying to kill me. That's one of those nice things about life. Sometimes there's a horrible monster trying to kill you. I don't know why I'm going in here. I don't think there was anything else in here. Yeah, it's still nothing else in here. There's literally boxes and crates of ammunition. Like... 105 ammunitions in here. I don't know what that really means, but I know that I would like it. As well as, you know, a gun to maybe do it. Throwing bullets at people is not the most effective of things, but I mean, in a pinch it does. Maybe I have to aim it at his hand or something in particular. I don't know. I don't even know how this guy got here. Oh. Hmm. Or maybe I'm just lost. I don't know. Have I been in here? This is the room that uh, kept saying that I couldn't go in because it's like, oh, there's something in here. And apparently, you know, I was right. These doors are very variable as to whether or not they stop the monsters from bursting through like assholes. Fantastic. Okay, so am I seriously not capable of cutting your hand off? I'm thinking I would like this guy's hand. Okay, well, whatever. Hmm. I suspect I've missed something very fundamental and important, but I have no idea what that would be. Um... Okay, so we've got... Nothing particularly useful right now. And there is a monster roaming these halls, so that's fun. There's the question as to where it is. Hmm. Okay, I might have to actually just outright look up something. It's saying that corpse was important, but how do I get down to where it was? Well, let's... Yeah, and there's a dead guy down the hallway that I could be using for the hand scanner. Maybe he's not important enough to get into the library, but I don't know what kind of library you'd have that wouldn't let people go in to read the books. Uh. Hmm. Not sure why I'm heading into here. What's in storage? No, there's nothing in storage. No, maybe I can take this guy's hand. Maybe that's the thing I can do. Let's go ahead and save before I try that. Alright. I may never get used to that, yeah. Oh. Alright, can I have your hand? Your hand looks like it's uh, ridiculously mangled. 
Neither usable hands nor eyes. You know who does have usable hands? Is that, what is that sound? Like, I'm pretty sure that bug was a hallucination that that stupid thing in my brain decided is now totally an existent thing, but uh, apparently it's still there. Well, whatever. Doesn't seem to have anything to do with me. Okay, so we can't use that guy's hand. Don't really know what to do now. Maybe I needed to hit the power in the machine room? You, sir, are a jerk. Apparently, we can actually just go into the machine room. Like, the gas is actually gone now. It didn't seem like that, because, like, you can't tell when the gas is gone when you're wearing this thing. Let's just wear it anyway for a little while, I guess. So this is probably going to get us killed, but we're going to go in here and figure out what's going on in here. Oh, there is still gas in here. Alright, so I have no idea what's going on in here. I can't figure out what on earth I'm supposed to be doing. Let's check this thing. Apparently I can't actually do anything with that anymore. Interesting. So yeah, I'm wondering if I can... I was wondering what I was talking about. It's like, you're gonna get eaten or something. I don't know. Oh. Okay, well, let's, uh, scoot over just a little bit. Um. Alright, so let's... Ah. Okay, that probably killed me. Yeah. But I think, I think I had to actually try and kill that worm. Okay, well this sucks. <laughs> Alright, well... You know, it's one of those situations that's like, giant thing causing rumbling. I thought I was actually getting crushed by uh, debris because I couldn't see the worm the first time I was in there because that stupid gas mask is so obtuse, I guess. But, uh, yeah, I don't really know 100% for sure, but I'm pretty sure that we're supposed to kill that worm with the electricity. I think that's what's going on here. So we're gonna give that a try. Yeah, the first time he's like, you're gonna get eaten, I'm like, by what? I thought I was gonna get, like, smacked in the head by a boulder and die from that, but apparently there's a worm there. It's a bit of a, bit of a dick. Just a little bit. Yeah, 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 whatever. Okay, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to shock the worm, so... It's that kind of puzzle. Alright, you let's get the save point. Uh-huh. Okay, so... Stand over here, just wait to see where he's gonna come out of. Yeah, hello. Now, if we stand over here, we can induce it to go over that way. Okay, so it came out the same one again, but, uh, you know what? That's fine. Oops. Oops. Okay, well, we fell down a hole. You know what? It's fine. Oh, what the? Oh. Okay, so we don't need that thing. That's going to help tremendously, I suspect. Yeah, hello, Wormy. Okay, so we want to wait till there's a bit of rumbling. Okay, perfect. Can we go it's in here? It's not too late to just slam your head against the wall until you pass out, you know. It might be easier than carrying on. You know, the one thing that keeps me going is that when I finally work out how to end all this, you're coming with me. Uh-huh. You're not a very helpful thing, are you? Okay, now the question is... What did that actually accomplish? 
not quite right. Fantastic. Okay. Um. Hmm. Alcohol? I don't know what I'm thinking. I have no idea what I'm thinking. I think that this is all some sort of crazy situation. Like, what the hell is this thing even? I can only assume that that's basically a hallucination. Yeah, so I outright legit just have to find a way to get that hand now, using this worm? How is this worm supposed to help me? Uh. Hmm. Okay, let's see if we can't. Yeah, I, I, I just cannot go forward through these uh, tunnels here. What else do I even have in my inventory? I could use here. Oh, I can walk along the worm. I don't see how this is particularly useful, actually. Yeah, and I don't get very far, so not helpful there. Hmm. What do I have in my inventory that I could use here? Um... Nope. You know, he just wanted a little bit of a snack, you know? Figured if I give him the head, maybe he'd... Oh! Alright. Did not think that was there. There we go. Okay, so that's that's that accomplished apparently. Or all that is. Uh-huh. Okay, I never remember if I check these drawers or not. I don't know why I even care. I have so many batteries that I don't use. Probably because my aspect ratio is turned up a little bit wonky, but whatever. I still say that this would be fantastic to just bring along with me. Like I mean I know I'm passing up things like ammunition for what I would hypothetically assume is a gun. Oh, there's another straight metal rod here. I carried that all the way- oh, whatever. But yeah, I mean, hypothetically, I'm assuming that there are just things that I could have done here. Still won't budge. Okay. Um, but yeah, I think that actually... This was really short, but I think we're gonna call it an episode here, just because I'm trying to get... You know, enough filler episodes for while I'm literally out of the country. And actually, I don't think this has been too short. Well, maybe it has been a little bit too short, but... I suspect that I'm going to get killed on the way to the library, so I'm not too eager to go there right now. But I've gotten killed a bunch of times already, I guess. At least we're not getting door camps by anything. See, I don't get why I can't use his hand. What's he even doing there? Seriously, what are you doing there, Ben? It's probably gonna get up one of these times. Alright. What was that? I think How I'm... peculiar. I could have sworn we remembered there being a door here before. How queer! What's in that direction? Oh, silly old me. I haven't got any hands to point with, have I? Did you go into my brain and remove the library, asshole? I can't believe you did that. Did you just put it back? I mean... It would not be all that difficult for you to just put the library back in my brain. Ah, oh, whatever. map of the area. Library is this way. Go on, library. Spontaneously manifest yourself back into existence, please. Ah, uh, whatever. Okay. I know he's trying to kill me, but either way, let's close this door. This door is not closed very elegantly. Anyway, so, yeah, there's supposed to be a library here. It's like... Approximately there-ish. 
wonder if I can sweep this across until I get it. Rubbing a, I'm literally rubbing a head against a wall because I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be a door here. And uh, they say that I'm going crazy. Well, hand, do you have any insight on this? Also no. Right. Fantastic. Okay, so he's trying to get me killed in some way or another. Let's, I guess, check these doors. I'm not sure if this is the direction he was referring to when he was talking about what's over there. Huh. Yeah, I have no idea which direction he was referring to because as he says himself, he has no hands. It's a map of the area. Library number four. It's exactly where I thought it was. No, not that way. You sure you know where we're going? Didn't we pass the door just back there? You're being a dick. You're such a dick. You're the dickiest of dicks. You're Sir Richard Dick of Dixon. You see? You silly Billy. It was here all along. Would you like Uncle Clarence to take the steering wheel for a while? For some reason I thought it was Clarice. <laughs> you should see your face. <laughs> this is actually gonna be fun. Perhaps I won't get you killed after all. Ah, uh, you're such a troll. Alright, here we go. There we go. Uh. Alright, so we're in the library now. It's a pretty nice place, actually. I wouldn't mind a library like this. That'd be nice. But anyway, yeah. Let's uh, go ahead and save. And we'll call this our episode for now. I think we're just about out of here. I don't know why I get the feeling, but... Uh, yeah, I get the feeling like we're just about done this game. So, anyway, I hope you found this enjoyable, and of course, as always, I hope to see you all next time.